conditions are a lot better than they've been we still have a mortician's rig hooked up 40 pound main line 20 pound snood got a white cutlass float a piece of electric chicken fish bites times two and a four ounce sinker guy spudnik this is going to be our 13 foot rod in our number one position we're going to cast this about uh 10 o'clock get it a little bit over to the left spread out make some room for ourselves and we're going to keep getting our lines out but we'll see what we can catch perfect it's right where i want it darker water we know that blue runner are here ladyfish so we're gonna have to be wading through some of those fish to get to the pompano today it's just how it's gonna be As we had just got number one out i'm still baiting up number two and braden is on we'll see what he's got I'm gonna say it's a blue runner. What do you think? I kind of feel the rudder. It, it, you can kind of feel their tail, but it's not giving me as much of the rudder tail that as they usually do. It doesn't feel real big. He, he fights, but he doesn't feel super big. And he's oh, he's racing him. He's going in far to the side. I saw him, but he did, I, I couldn't see that real well. My, I guess, is, my guess is blue runner. Yeah, but. I don't expect it to be a pompano, but you never know. You see him right there. Oh, wait, is that a pump? It could be a pump. That's pretty far right. All right, so we're going to go try to see what it is. Yeah, it's a pompano. That's a keeper. Sweet. Yeah, man, that's awesome. That's probably, that's probably a 12. I didn't take long at all. Nice job, buddy. Let's lean it up there. We'll take him off and I'll, we'll go cast it back. Great, man. Great start. Let's check it out. We've been here about two minutes and we've already got a keeper pump. Hope that continues. Nice job, buddy. We're gonna use Frisky Finn's new rattle rigs. These awesome little rigs have just the right about a noise to help attract some fish. But we're gonna connect that on our, our 12 foot Frisky Finn's rod and help us try to catch some fish. getting ready to throw number three we've got a nice little cut here if you guys can see this where the water is breaking here not breaking there so it's deeper water this is our eight foot uh, pen squadron three rod paired with a slammer one 3600 and we're gonna place this really close yeah we got a standard double drop rig got a piece of shrimp and sand flea fish bites Anchored by a three ounce sinker guy Sputnik and we're going to cast it about 20 yards real close. And this is just a standard four ounce pyramid sinker. This is like a 60 pound liter, a five aught circle hook with a piece of cut mullet looking for a redfish. We're going to let this one soak for a good bit and We'll see when we find a red. Try to get it on the other side of the bar. All right, it's there. Sweet. And uh, this is a Pen Battalion 2 rod, 11 foot, paired with a Pen 3 Slammer 6500. Like something bumped into it. It's 
got a pretty big bump on number two and then nothing so maybe a fish or a stingray ran into the line but we're not hooked to anything Braden just tightened up the line and we'll wait and see what happens Kitty, kitty, kitty. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Oh, it's a whiting. Yeah. I see him out there. Yeah, I think it's a red. Can you go land him? Bring him up, buddy. Use the wave to your advantage. Nice. That might be a slot, red, buddy. He might be a slot. Yeah, he's bigger than that. You think? Yep. Oh, yeah. Awesome job, man. Awesome job. That, yes. That's be great. Man, that's what we're talking about. That is what we fish for. Clean out my hands and I'll take a picture for you. Okay. I caught this beautiful redfish on some cut bait. He's a nice fish. He's probably he's probably a bull, but that's a great fish. Release him back. Alright buddy, let's release him.
Nice job, buddy. You got my GoPro all the way through. It's all right. That's uh, that's what we fish for right there. We're in the middle of doing a bait check, and this is on the Frisky Fins rod and also the Frisky Fins new uh, battle rig with the noisemaker. You can see a fish crushed it. I'm going to still fish with it, but I'm probably, I've, I believe I've lost my sound making capability. But they obviously like it. They hit it and tore it up. Are you on? There's your blue runner. Could be. Is it still on? Oh yeah, you're pulling it. It's a whiting. That's a tiny, that's a cat. Yep. All right, lean it for me. Let's throw it back. Number five species for the day. This is a puffer fish. Braden has been praying for redemption. About 15 minutes ago, we had a great strike on this rod and we lost the fish and Braden's felt terrible ever since. So I think we got a quality strike and we hope it's a pop. This one pops up too, I'm like that. Oh yeah. I feel like I'm so I hope that it doesn't get Oh, it's going left. What do we got? Ah, that's a hardtail. That's a hardtail. Well, that's species number six for the day. That left one was a hardtail. Deck on it. All right, buddy, take it off and we'll uh, throw it back out. I enjoy watching these ospreys fly around. These guys are hunters and they need fish to live and they find the fish. Looking around and they got some talons. We'll go down and grab a fish. Let's see what he's doing. All right. Let's see what we got on this 13 footer. It doesn't, it's not fighting like a pompano. Ooh, a little bit of, a little bit of weight. It's kind of stationary. That's not too hard. Let's see what this fish is. I don't know if it's a pomp. I'd be happy with a good sized whiting. We're close. Where's he going? Going left now? Oh yeah, there he's, he's fighting now. That could be a pomp. They just turned on. Yeah, that's a pompano. Pompano! Sweet. That's a solid 13, 14. Daddy. Yeah, that's a big one. Pick it up. Let's see it. There we go, there we go. One for the good guy. Let's see that fish. Hold it up for the camera. Nice. Hold, hold it, let me take it off so we can send it back out.
pompano number three of the day. Let's go ahead and measure him. He's definitely a keeper, but just to get you an idea of how big he is. Put his nose on zero. And that's 12 and a half inch to the Fort Pompano. Nice. Guys, we are all packed up uh, from Pensacola Beach. We had a pretty good fishing day. We caught a lot of different species. We caught a lot of the fish we were after. We caught a nice 30 inch redfish. We caught three keeper pompano, two pretty good whiting. We caught a puffer and what else did we catch, Braden? Catfish. We got a hardtail and nobody really wants to talk about catfish. We got a couple of those little rascals too. But all in all, a really good day. The uh, conditions on the beach are adequate. We had a lot of fun. Last weekend, we worked really hard to get some fish, but today it was actually fun. So if you get a chance, get out to the beach. The fish are running, lots of different species showing up. It should be a great time. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you guys on the beach.